while you're still reading it? Yeah. Drive me a little crazy, then. Cause Why? I, just, I wanted to know more about Dad. Cause I don't, I don't know that much about him. My dad passed away when I was eight, and I didn't really get the chance to know him. I mean, I remember, like, he worked out a lot. He was super clean. He was athletic. He was into disco, a lot of disco. He would work out with disco music on. Brushed his hair, had his little chain on, his five chain on. It was so funny. Oh, it's so cute, all the pictures you have of them together. That's their wall right there. You look so much like your dad, for sure. What other questions do you have? I want to know like, if there was like any um, family members from his side that are um, struggling with sexuality problems. What do you mean? Like... A like gay, you mean, or something? Yeah. Oh, um... I don't think on his side. I've known about the homosexuality on my mom's side of the family, but I've never really known anything about my, my dad's side. Like, if anyone's had curiosity, like I have in my life. Do you think it's, like, genetic? I personally think so. I believe that there are some people that become gay with, like, certain life experiences or just by choice, but I do feel that there are people that are born gay. I know Johnny's always struggled with his sexuality, but the fact that he's asking so straight up right now is kind of like, oh, okay, you know, we're getting somewhere. How do you feel? Like, what do you think about that? No, I've, I've, I've gone back and forth on it because I don't think you can really help who you love, you know? Mm hmm Do you prefer, like, one or the other more? Or you don't know yet, you're not sure? I don't know. The very first time that I talked to Johnny about his sexuality, he must have been around 12, 13, and he cried and he said, sister, I'm, I'm just confused. I'm confused and, and I'm sure that I'm not gay and I, and I like girls. And I said, okay, are you sure? And I tried to reassure him it's okay, but he fought it for a very, very long time. How do you think like the rest of the family would react if I tell them? Um, they all have their beliefs. You know, mom had her beliefs as well. They're just, they're Christian. They were raised Christian, very traditional in that sense. You know, Tia Rosie and Jackie are a little bit more open-minded, but grandma and Tia Juan, I think they're gonna probably say, I don't necessarily agree with it, but I have your back and I support you. Your grandma will probably go a little bit deeper and tell you, well, the Bible says, and this and this and that, it should be a woman and a man, and you know, and, and everyone has their beliefs, but I don't want you to worry about that. And I feel like, He's kind of testing me to see, okay, what would you think? Or what would the family think? Because he's still afraid. He's still struggling with this. Are you ready to tell the family? I honestly don't know. Okay. I think the thing that's always scared me is I don't want to have that conversation with certain people because I don't want to hear what they have to say because I don't want that to change my love for them. I want to look at them the same way. So can you say right now, like, you're gay or you can't? I don't know. Okay. Even though my sister's open, it's been difficult to talk to her about this subject because she's my second mom. She's raised me. Though she wants to support you, she wants answers too. And I don't even know if I'm necessarily ready. I wanna just go run in a cave and hide. Just take your time. The good thing is that you have your sister slash second mom that loves you and accepts you just the way you are. Okay? Okay. All right. And when you're ready to tell the family, then I'll be here too. Okay? Okay. Wow, it's a whole lot of information in one day, huh? I love you. I love you more. Hi, everyone. Este, yo y Johnny queríamos hacer este video porque, como me imagino que se han dado cuenta, uh, ciertas cosas que han pasado en la